Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to Wonder Kid Watch where today we're taking a look at Soteris Alexandropoulos, uh, a player that was mentioned in the comments down below. So make sure you leave any comments down below of any players you want to see in upcoming episodes. But today, like I say, it's the midfielder at 19 years old, already made an appearance for the Greek national team. Looks very well rounded in central midfield, which is very nice. At Panathinaikos, making 39 appearances already. Uh, let's take a look at his attributes. So he's his current ability is 115, 135 potential ability, so could be a solid, solid player in the future. So with that said, let's jump 10 years on and take a look at how he gets on. And here we are then, 10 years on, 29 years old now, made 73 more appearances for the Greek national team, scoring 12 goals as well. Uh, looks very well-rounded with mentals. Look at that. Uh, so many 12s and 13s, a couple of 14s and 15s in there as well. Uh, physicals looking quite nice as well. A pacey central midfielder, which is always good. Um, and technicals aren't too bad either. You can see he's moved to Swansea, so he has certainly moved around in the world. Uh, let's take a look at his history. We can see a 3.6 million pound move to Udinese followed his time at Panathinaikos, where he performed pretty well. Uh, and then during that move, not much occurred until an £8 million move to Swansea when they were in the Premier League. Uh, unfortunately, he did get relegated with them, uh, did leave in, leading to a 7.37 average rating in the Championship, which is very, very good indeed. Let's take a look at his milestones then. Did he get any competitions? So he made his international appearance and obviously got a goal as well for Greece. But we can see the relegation from the Premier League only led to a promotion in the championship by winning the league so he's obviously was very he contributed a lot to that season uh was even became supporters player of the year so that just shows how influential he was for Swansea he was also supporters player of the year for Udinese as well uh, in his final season there so he's clearly has an influence on the fans they obviously like him when he plays for him uh, can also see he was uh, third place in the Greek Super League Player of the Year and Super League Talent of the Year third place as well. So regarded pretty highly, I have to say. £59,000 a week as well. Let's take a look at his attributes then to wrap things up. Only four points off the total of 135. I mean, I'd say he's pretty damn good for the level he's at. So I, if you can get him in the Championship, lower level Premier League club, sure, Definitely as a backup, at least um, worth bringing him in, uh, especially if you can get him for the three point six million pounds as well. But there you go. We will leave it there. Thank you very much for watching. Make sure you leave a like, subscribe to the channel and leave a comment down below of any players you want to see in upcoming episodes. And I'll catch you in the next one.